Hi everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel. So this might be our most in-demand video at the moment. Currently in third trimester and just trying to get the house ready for baby. And you guys want to see the house updates. I think you've been seeing some sneak peeks over on our Instagram. Um, a few things have changed in particular, the biggest being the kitchen area. We've had that all done. But I'll take you on another grand tour of the house and show you everything that has changed. So coming in from the front door, we still have a million packages. That's the nursery rocking chair to be built, waiting for Shane. But if you come through, this is where the biggest transformations happened. You'll see the kitchen is now really dark. It's not, the whole house was so much wood before. But we've changed the lounge area up um, and got new sofas. So we've gone for like this cream champagne velvet sofa um it's super super soft and i've also now instead of before it was just a small sofa here i've added in an armchair as well so it's, this is just originally this was going to have a tv and everything in it whereas now it is literally kind of like adult communal space um and we'll just all sit and chat while people are cooking in the kitchen but these sofas are new i got them off of slf24 um, they are a European company that offer a delivery within like two weeks. So I just wanted something that could get here fast. Um, we have ordered a different sofa for our main living room three months ago, and it's still over two months away that it's going to arrive. So that just threw me off ever using, um, that company again. So yeah, this one was from SLF24 and it offered really, really fast delivery. This chair has become Nico's. She does not give it up. Um, and it is my favourite while pregnant. It's just so comfortable. I actually want to get the matching footstool. Um, so I can just properly lounge in it. But yeah, this is like my favourite area of the house. Um, I will leave a link to this in the description box below. We've gone for the James corner sofa and matching armchair. And as I said, I'm going to get the footstool as well. And the shade I've gone for is the velvet fabric in colour beige veluto. Um... But yeah, super, super soft. Really, really happy with that. And I love it because it's the like light contrast against the super dark kitchen. So you'll see here we've gone for like a navy, almost kind of like grey. It's not really coming up on the blueness of it isn't coming up on camera. But um, we've got all gold hardware. These were original, the brass um, hinges. So we kind of wanted to get a nice, well, it's brass, it's not gold, handle to match. Um... So yeah, this is the kitchen. Some bits are still to be replaced. Um, for example, we need to get rid of them bar stools. We just really are indecisive on what... Oh, it looks kind of navy there now, actually. You can see the naviness of it. Um, but yeah, we had this all um, spray painted. So they took the doors away. There's a separate kitchen transformation video coming with full details. We had a whole week without any kitchen cupboards. It was a nightmare. Um, don't know if you've seen this fridge. It's well, well cool. That sounds thing but um it's a smart fridge so it's got like you can play the radio and everything on it put your to-do lists up um obsessed with the fridge uh coming through got like shoe storage i do want to get all built-in storage here and these canvases came with the house we need to replace them but yeah i want to get that all built in eventually mia's playroom hasn't changed much but the sofa that was um the gray one is going to come in here eventually when the main living room is furnished. But yeah, this is Mia's playroom. Um, she's been busy in here. Teddy with his favorite toy. All right, Ted. And then coming back here, we've got the utility, which is kind of like the dog kitchen. It's a mess, actually, I thought I'd cleaned it. We've also had this all redone before it was all wood. Um, so we've had it all spray painted. I've gone for a lighter color in here just because of the size of the kitchen with some black candles. And then we're gonna get the worktop wrapped. Um, I'm gonna replace all the flooring because it's all chipped in here. Um, but again, that'll be on, I'll show you some of the chips over here. Um, and then it's just covered, there's nothing new in there. Um, downstairs toilet, nothing exciting there, nothing's changed. Um, it's just the downstairs living shower room, which will eventually be a dog shower just not done yet um coming through i forgot to show you the dining room are you gonna hop up on the sofa ted um sorry i get so out of breath now by the way guys it's third trimester 
So this is the dining room, same dining table that we had before. It is to be replaced. I actually want Shane to turn this into a coffee table for the main living room um, eventually. But yeah, that's the dining room at the moment and all our artwork is still on the floor. All the walls are bland just because we're going to repaint the entire house. It's this kind of like off-white colour that's almost got a blue tinge to it in certain lights and I don't like it. Big stretch. Um... Then over into the hallway, nothing much has changed here. Got a few plants, electric bike. Um, and then this is the main living room that needs the most work. This is just kind of like dumping, like we don't even have a, um, what do you call it? TV unit, it's on the floor. Because we don't know where the TV's gonna go, if it's gonna go above the fireplace or um, if it's gonna go in this corner. And then this is where the other couch is at the moment. and. The really really old ones it's it really is just a dumping ground at the moment um we need to sort that room that's the next one on our list i also it's got this beautiful fireplace um but the old owners never actually used it so we need to make it usable i think it needs a new chip like something in the chimney and we're going to have a log burner in there hopefully in time for winter um so yeah that's a big that's probably the next biggest thing we want to do is the fireplace um, and a sofa is on order for here but as i said months so far we've been waiting for it and still got months to go um the staircase we get loads of questions on about for the dogs and like the flooring around dog grip and we are really struggling at the moment to find a joiner to um what can i say about this we don't want to be able to see through the staircase back basically because we want to get a carpet runner going up the center of it but in order to do that we need these bits blocks boxed in and in order to do that, it's all um, slotted together. The way it's been built, you'd have to take the entire staircase apart. So we're trying to find a joiner who can do something where they just put a face on the front of it, because otherwise it's a huge, huge job. Um, so yeah, we do want to replace the stairs and make carpet for fill and everything to get up, but it's turning out to be a lot. It could be an entirely new staircase that we would need to get, um, which we don't want to do. So yeah, just trying to find the right tradesman to do the job so that they would all look like this, basically. Oh, dog's coming up too, bear with. Yeah, we need them all to look like this so that you can't see through. And then we can start looking at carpets and flooring and stuff. Um, next big change would be over here. We've now got our kind of like lounge area. As I said before, I didn't know what to do with this area. Um, I think at Christmas, I'll take the coffee table away and we'll have a giant Christmas tree here. But yeah, we've got these gorgeous velvet chairs. They spin. Yeah, it's just a super comfy area. And this is actually where I read Mia her bedtime stories at night. We come and sit on this chair. Oh, I feel like I need a little breather. Um, this is Mia's room now. So she's got all new furniture, I've gone for a white. Um, new bed. We've actually, I, oh. These two. Um, she's got a little bookcase. They're just gonna be playing. And then over here, and her doll, doll's house is broken. I don't know how that happened. That's a work in progress. We're rudely interrupted by two playful dogs. I also got this really cool light off Amazon. It's not gonna really show in the daytime. Basically, it's just an LED strip. And it's the perfect night light and it's got a dimmer switch. It was like £15 off Amazon. But at night time, that is the perfect night light for her. And I just literally stuck it to the back of the bed. Um, can't show you. But yeah, that was just, I saw somebody on TikTok do it. And I had to co copy. What is happening right now? You guys. They are just really hyper. Right, next room, the nursery. Next big change. Oh, Milo's coming up. Um, so this is the nursery as it stands. Look at them hoover lines. Love my robotic hoovers. Um, the furniture that was in Mia's room and the um, that was the bed we turned, turned it back into a crib is now in here. Um, that's still the changing table still needs to be made and my hospital bag needs to be packed. I 
fear that they've just made a mess of other bedrooms now. They have, haven't they? You guys. I'm trying to film a video. This is our other guest room, also known as the dog's bedroom currently. Um, and it is my home office as well. And this is the room that's got the best view going out here, if you remember. <coughs> Beautiful day. Um, <coughs> please don't do that on the bed. But yeah, this is the other guest bedroom with art that's got a rolled bed in it. And then going across, got the main bathroom, no changes there. <coughs> They love the slippery floors, by the way. He's just running between the beds now. Sweet Lord. This house tour should be done by Nico and Teddy. You good? You sure you're good? Cool. Okay, come in. Okay, we're just, we're going with this, guys. This chaos, we're, we're just gonna rock with it. Makes the house tour more interesting. Um, this is our bedroom minus Shane. God, that sounds rough. Uh, mine and Shane's. The bed was made, and then Teddy came, like so. Oh, he's just doing zoomies amongst the house. But yeah, this is. I've got a new mirror, big mirror. Hello, baby bump. Oh, he knocked her over. Um, I need to get all new furniture in here, but I haven't found anything I like yet. My poor bed. Um, but yeah, this is our bedroom. Nothing much has changed other than we've got a big uh, super king bed. Bathroom, again, nothing has changed in here. En suite. And then, oh my God. The only bed that hasn't been terrified yet. And I might just close the door behind me. Oh no, it has, he's been in here too. Um, this is the other guest bedroom. Yeah, this is like the main guest bedroom. Uh, you've got a dressing table, bedside. We have ordered some furniture for here, but again, it hasn't arrived yet. Just like the little walk-in wardrobe and shower, out utility. Um, yeah, that is the house as it stands. <laughs> And now I need to remake some beds. Teddy! What did you do? My goodness. You've even got the fitted sheet off the mattress. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. I need to tidy the house again. See you in the next one.